All right, y'all. So in that last video, we did see that I did receive a message saying that there is a marriage season coming, child. I have no idea what's to that. So I said, let me go ahead and jump into a, a, a reading on that. Remember, we're doing moon messages tonight. So we're receiving those things that are hidden, that are shadow things. And we did have that prophecy come through. So let's see what's what. We see Ten of Swords energy. So we know some things are coming to an end. We see endings. And we see awakeness. Now, pause. That last reading, we focused on how many of the males in the collective are kind of being brought to a place of five of cups energy and grief so that they can realize who their wives are and they can go ahead and go through that grieving season. OK, so that's where our marriage season comes through next. So we see, boom, there's some hard endings coming. Ten of swords. Then we see some awakeness coming. Then we see some three of wands. OK, we see some people coming through some things spiritually. Okay, men, the emperor, boom, we're getting the same message. Three of wands, the emperor. Okay, so we're seeing some men are going to be brought through some hard endings so they can hit these awakenings and they can transcend into emperor energy. Okay, and they can have some things to balance. They need to balance some things out, bring some things together, alchemize some things, temperance, so that they can choose their queen of swords. Okay, they can know what woman to bring into their lives. Okay, we see queen of wands. We see some men are going to really be coming through. We see swords energy, okay? Some of our women that are really thinkers, mental speakers, wands. Some of our women that are seriously uh, passionate, fire signs. King of Pentacles energy, okay? King of Pentacles energy. These men are going to be making some serious decisions. King of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. We see some men bossing up and going ahead, stepping into legacy again. We see marriage season. Some men are going to be bossing up, stepping into their legacies, okay? Knight of Pentacles, again. We're seeing some offerings being made. Okay, we're seeing some offerings being made. Ace of Cups. We see some love overflowing. We see some potential pregnancies coming into the mix. Okay, Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands. We see these men pushing through and breaking through some barriers to get to the bottom line of what's what. Two of Swords. We see some men returning to some women in this marriage season. They're coming to, to, to form a truce because they've been betraying you in the past. Five of Swords. Men who betrayed you in the past, they're about to come back. They want a truce. They want to bring peace. They want to rekindle star energy. They want to rekindle. They want to step into a place of optimism and hope between y'all. They're tired of y'all fighting, okay? They're tired of it being a delay and a wait between y'all, okay? Where everything's all effed up, screwed up, okay? Hangman energy and they can't get to you. They're tired of that. They're tired of being alone. They're finna come to you with that. The hermit energy, they're finna come back because they're tired of being alone, sitting around, being introspective, thinking about you. They're sick of it. Okay, they've been going back and forth in their mind about you for I don't know how long. Two of Pentacles. And these men are going to start coming back because they're realizing now what they gave up. We see men that are realizing what they gave up, what they let happen. Okay, how they were the ones who ruined relationships that could have led to Ten of Pentacles, you know, family legacy energy. Okay, they gave up marriages that could have led to Ace of Cups, strong family and pregnancy and fertility uh, energy. They've walked away from good things. They've walked away from good women. And you've had some men now that have had time to sit back and really think about that, okay? They realize now that you was walking away because you didn't want to support their bullshit. You was walking out on them because you saw it. they wasn't doing right. These men have had time to sit back and think about this, okay? You wasn't doing right. I mean, they wasn't doing right. And you said, I'm not going to take it. I cannot give you what you want for, for what you want or deserve. I'm sorry. These men are having to deal with the fact that they was walking out because they didn't feel like they was good enough to be there in the first place, okay? I feel unbalanced and uneasy. I don't know what to do to fix it. These men, again, some of these men had to go back and look and deal with their mental health. They was all over the place. I am keeping secrets from you and I hope you don't find out. These men are about to return and tell you. A lot of women, they finna tell you these secrets. They about to tell you these secrets. They gonna let you know. I cannot listen to your voice. It affects my soul. Some of these men are gonna, are gonna face it because the reason they don't want to hear your voice is because they've been sitting around lying. And they don't want to hear your voice because they know they just finna do more lying. They finna do more crummy energy. There's a heavy five of cups energy over a lot of the males in the masculine right now. I am seeing someone, but I am not ready for you to know about them yet. You're not going to never know about them, girl. You're not going to never know about them. This is somebody he was seeing out of shame. A lot of men are going to come out of these damn rebound relationships. Y'all know how it go. Just pick up whoever the hell so you don't have to think about how you did the right person. I feel alone and in the dark. Where is my light? A lot of men are going to come back for that reason. They are flat out depressed. 
without the woman that they know damn well they should have did right by. I feel empty and hollow inside. I can't open up right now. This is why they walked out. They're about to let that go. You know that you may not feel for me as I feel. You know that you may, I know that you may not feel for me as I feel for you. This man is insecure as hell because wasn't none of that even true. He just told himself that. I tried to run from this connection, but my soul craves you. So he's coming back, point blank, period. Rejecting you was protecting myself. I was being selfish. A lot of these men have come into realizations, finally. Okay? And they're coming to these realizations. They're about to start coming back. Okay? These men are about to start coming back. Because they're coming into the realizations of who they are and what they did. And the role that they played in a lot of this mess. Okay? Okay? The role that they played in a lot of this mess. I am finally seeing my worth that I still feel unworthy of love. Low self-esteem had them running off. I am distracting myself to avoid thinking of you, okay? They're going to have to stop all of that eight of pentacles energy that they're in. They're going to come back. I have lost faith in you and cannot see a future with you anymore. They know that's how you felt. That's why you was gone. These men are really having to come to terms with who they are, okay? I knew I was losing you, but I didn't do anything to fight for you. A lot of these men know that they just sat there and was weak and let the whole relationship fall apart. But you can expect them to come back and try to make it right. Okay? Some of y'all, within four years, these men had destroyed these relationships. Even in the last reading, we see October. October on a Saturday. If y'all from the Midwest, we could be talking about Sweetest Day. Okay? Just wait and see. Okay, this whole four years, a lot of y'all four is very significant. And I've been seeing four, I think in the last two days, I've seen four, 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 or four, 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 or four, 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 probably 17 or 18 times. So these things are about to be stable on all four sides. People are coming back, okay? Okay, we see October is going to be a time. Now, let me tell y'all something about this. Even the window for which all of this stuff could happen could take four years, okay, for some of y'all. You know, a lot of these dudes... Things be taking longer than they should. But the window to this marriage season starts in October. Okay? The beginning of this marriage season starts in October. Period. Okay? Within two weeks, some of y'all are going to hear from these men. So this is our marriage reading, y'all. I'm telling y'all this message reached out to me in the last reading. I had no idea. I actually thought my last reading was my last reading, reading for the evening. This, this reading said, no, this message got to go out. 16, 16. Okay, we see willpower. Even though things are filling out of sync and not within your control, the divine is asking that you remember that you are being supported and that your will is your willpower. Okay, determination is your key. So y'all, keep yourself confidence together. Things are about to fall together. Destiny, what I just say, things are about to fall together. Destiny. 999. Nine, nine. Release your expectations because you're about to see something happen. We're moving into a marriage season. Some of your visions are about to come true right in front of your face. One, two, three. Okay. I know y'all caught that divine feminine tarot. See, y'all don't even have to ask. Okay. Things are about to change for many of us in this love department. Okay. Look at this. Tanker, celebration, fun, and enjoyment. Things are about to really change. It's about to be some totally new things coming into the collective in terms of marriage and relationships. Um, four years is the absolute longest is what I'm hearing. But some of y'all, that is what it's going to be because it took y'all four years to get into the mess that y'all into today. But in October, we start seeing some people making their way back. We start seeing some men come back, making changes, saying they're making changes and giving things a try. And within two weeks, some of y'all are going to hear back from these people, even if it's just a text message. Okay. I know y'all caught that. Divine Feminine Tarot T. Please make sure to go ahead, like, um, share, subscribe, and I will catch y'all in the next one.